Yo, what is shaking bacon? We got a little bit of a different video here for you today. We are going to be doing an unboxing. Get over the good secret box bandit and prepare for the most unpleasant pillow fight of your life. I got some pike fly tying stuff in from Sweden because I've been watching Fly vs. Jerk on YouTube on the channel Canal Grazi. I believe that's how it's pronounced. Please. Don't push me if it's not. Um, I'm not Swedish or Finnish or wherever the company is originated from. Um, very excited to open it. I kind of forgot what I ordered, uh, but I'm gonna leave a link to the website or the YouTube channel. Um, go ahead and check these guys out. Check out Fly vs. Jerk, such an amazing series. Uh, I think I've binge watched like four seasons in like two weeks. So I have no shame, it's that good. So we're gonna op open this guy here. Looks like a little little goodie bag maybe. Got some swim baits. Some swim baits through an extra. Well, thank you with this order. You help us produce more free fishing movies on our YouTube channel and are also part of the community. Nice little thank you. So I got some trout predator hooks. Um, we're actually gonna use these for pike. Uh, they're a little bit lighter. Uh, so that way my flies don't sink as fast. I can fish them a little bit higher in the column. Um, I think that's why I got those. Also, A-Rex. I haven't used a lot of A-Rex hooks, but I've heard good things. I got the Glue Flexman. Love the logo on this guy. Um, this is going to be to make kind of disc heads. Um, and that's what these foam cylinders are for too. Make some disc heads, make sure our, our flies are pushing a lot of water. Um, just make these discs a little bit, a little bit more secure. Um, this was the big purchase here. These were kind of what I was most excited about. These dragon tails. We got a freaking massive pike on the back. It's a super fish. Okay. It's a super fish. It's so fucking fat. Love that. I uh, got some dragon tails, and then I got some fast attach clips uh, that I'm gonna attach to the trailer. And I got some, I did, they ran out, they didn't have any uh, uh, other things to tie these. I'm going to tie these to a thing and then I can switch out my tails pretty easy on my flies. Um, but excited to use these. Didn't realize that these are kind of to mimic the paddles on the fly and they move a lot of water. And so those pike have a big lateral line because, you know, they're just long and snake-like. Um, so that moves some water, that gets the pike excited. I uh, got some predator eyes, predator eyes, more fast attach, more predator eyes. Um, I got some pike beads, the Bauer pike beads. Um, now that I see these, these look like just like normal tungsten beads, um, but these are to put in front of like two plies and stuff to get the fly a little bit extra depth. Um, worth a shot. I saw he was doing that in season 12 or whatever season I was watching. Well, zap a zap, zap a gap brush on if I could speak. Uh, add a little bit of durability to the flies. I also got some pipe tubes. Um, we've got a, I got a tube fly uh, adapter for my vise, and going to be tying some different tube flies um, for pike. Also, I got the double dragon tail. So when you watch. Uh, the one episode, Pierre and uh, Truman, uh, they always fish the Mira's mouse with like a, almost like an oversized like crawfish on the back. So hopefully tie up a little imitation of that and throw this guy on the back. Get some mimic mimicry there. We got some more dragon tails, we got the chartreuse. I don't know if I meant to get the double, double XL. We got those guys there. Got some orange ones. 
and I got the silver as well. Good mix of colors there. And I got some Flashaboo. Um, one thing he talks about in a lot of his videos on Fly TV uh, is to get the Magnum Flashaboo. And that's because it doesn't tangle as much, apparently, as the thinner stuff does. Um, so I got a good array of colors. Got some flies I want to tie up soon. Uh, so maybe you'll be seeing those on the channel sometime soon. Um, but yeah, Flashaboo. And then last thing, I just got more foam to make some discs. So other than that, they didn't have any adapters and they didn't have one of the things I need for the dragon tails to attach those. So I went and got those at a local fly shop. Um, but yeah, very excited to tie some flies. Really enjoyed the boxing. Uh, again, go check out the YouTube channel. Uh, that is the channel name right there, actually. Uh, so go check them out. Watch Fly vs. Jerk. Um, hopefully you'll be seeing some pike flies on the channel very, very soon. At least on the Instagram and the socials, which I'll leave in the description as well. So that's going to do it for this video. A lot of fun. I love getting stuff in the mail. And uh, we'll see you in the next one.